people that you give about an X-ray. An X-ray in Kenyatta National Hospital will not cost the same much in Aga Khan. You'll maybe pay, if it's an ultrasound, you'll pay probably 1,200 in Kenyatta, if at all you're paying. But in Aga Khan, you, you'll have to cough up something much. So we have the advocate's remuneration order, where well, each um, stipulates the minimums that you can charge. We have something called undercutting, which is uh, professional mis uh, misconduct. So where an advocate cannot charge less than this. So there's a minimum, but there's a maximum. minimum, but there's no maximum. Yeah. So. And you don't have a problem with that. <laughs> well, personally, no. I really do not have a problem with that <laughs> because I mean we are around um, how many lawyers? We're around twenty thousand. No, 18,000, 17,000 active yes. lawyers. Yeah. All of us cannot be charging, uh, exo I don't want to call it exorbitant because it's value. I mean, before I charge what I charge, there must be a reason. And but again, sorry? No, no, but in service of the people, I feel like this is a bit unfair. <laughs> uh, because then, if my mother in the village has a case, she would definitely go for the person she can afford. Are we then saying that this is of lesser quality as opposed to her sending me, her son, to go and find Ochiel, for example? And that's why we have the Law Society having the public interest litigation, legal aid and public interest litigation committees, both at the national office and the branch level. So in case you're there and you're not able to afford an advocate, we always have a way out. We, as I said, we work in partnership with other, um, other advocates, other institutions, and uh, for sure, for sure, you'll access justice if you really know the resources. And one thing that's the greatest challenge is actually lack of knowledge. Advocates are there, yes, costly ones, but again, there's also free legal aid, not only through the legal aid um, public interest litigation committees. Um, in my space of work, I know about the National Gender and Equality Commission that has uh, lawyers who carry out uh, gender-related cases for free. We have FIDA. Yeah. We have uh, organizations such as Kenya Alliance for the Advancement of Children. There are so many institutions, though working in silos, that are providing legal aid yeah. for free. Okay. Yeah, so, so legal aid is there, but the information, the knowledge is not out there, just how and where to access it. Okay, so we just need to streamline it. To stream, one, to streamline it, yeah. and also create awareness about uh, where these services are available. How can you access? Because it's one thing, me sitting down and saying, I enjoy offer pro bono services to maybe the specific cases. Yeah. But again, someone in the village where I come from doesn't have contact to Joy. So maybe just uh, uh, having the information trickle down to those yeah. people who need it most. All right.